Welcome to App Design Tips. This video is part of a free complete icon design tutorial. If you want to follow along, you can download the exercise files using the link in the description below. In this section, we're going to create a simple icon set and we can get started with a new document here. And the first thing I'm going to do is create an artboard and I will make this 128 pixels by 128 pixels just as before and I want to have a square grid I want to try uh, 8 pixels for each square size so now if I zoom in here we can see that this artboard is set up good and we're gonna have five icons here so we'll copy and paste four times and let's go ahead and name these artboards real quick notification Heart, Cloud, Chat, and Calendar. And now that we have everything set up, let's begin with this notification icon. So previously we had sketches for our icons, but these icons are going to be so simple we're not going to need sketches. So to start off, let's just create a rectangle. And I'll start off about right here. We'll do something like this and we can resize it afterwards so I'll use my select tool and I'm just going to hold down option to constrain to the center as I resize this down and I think something like that will work for the bell icon and we want this to have a curved top so I'm going to hold down option as I bring this down here towards the center and I'll bring this corner towards the center to be curved so that's looking good and I can always change my mind as far as where I want this part to land. And for right now, I want this to be a black fill. We'll start with black icons and we can add color to them later if we want. Now I want to add the bottom of this bell. So we'll do something like this. And again, if we want to copy this style, we can do Command C or Control C and then we'll paste this style, Option Command B. And that pasted the radiuses too, so I'm going to get rid of those radiuses. I just want it solid just like that. And actually, as I'm doing these, these grids are a little bit thick for my taste. So I'm going to select all of these artboards. And we can go into our grid settings here and just turn the opacity down. I like 10% because I can still see it. Uh, you may not be able to see it in the video, but it just I can see this a lot more clearly. And it kind of gets out of my way so I can see what the icon is going to look like. Now instead of this part being 8 pixels tall, I might want this to be 12. So a square and a half tall. And then we can go 1, 2, 3, 4. Just bring that in just a little bit. And I think I want the corners here to be rounded. Let's try uh, 2 here. So that's looking good. And then we can create a circle. And we want the circle to be 16 by 16. And let's use the same black color. And then I'm going to create a rectangle that's just four pixels tall. So let's change this to four pixels. And we can select both of these shapes here and subtract one from the other so that we have that nice looking bell. Last thing we want to do in this bell icon is just add a circle here near the top. So I'm going to start off with a circle like this towards the center. And I'll just resize this to be a little bit smaller something like this and then we can merge these two shapes together and there's our notification icon if you're enjoying this free icon design tutorial i have a complete course on learning adobe xd for ui ux design you can find a link in the description below with a steep discount included for my youtube fans this course will cover everything from learning the adobe xd interface to designing and prototyping an entire app from start to finish